an impenetrable fortress. In the ancient world, a fortress was built to give soldiers the battle's advantage by keeping them safely out of their enemy's reach. No soldier in their right mind would leave the safety of their fortress to fight unarmed and naked, but this is exactly what we do when we venture into the world without God. Whether we like it or not, a spiritual war is raging. God has built us an impenetrable fortress. The walls are his impregnable promises. He commands from within and offers a spiritual suit of armor for each of his Christian soldier, Ephesus 6 verse 10 until 13, yet often, when the enemy is not in sight, we don't feel the need to remain vigilant. We ignore God's commands, take off our armor and walk naked from the fortress in search of personal gratification, usually, straight into an ambush. Armed only with our own resources, it isn't long before we are completely subdued and sustain many injuries of disillusionment, misery, doubt, depression, worry, jealousy, bitterness, fear and hatred. We then typically run back to God's fortress crying, I was attacked, why didn't you help me? God's answer is always the same, soldier, you forsook my protection and left my fortress. You chose to go alone into life's battlefield. It was you who deserted your post, I have remained at mine. The gates of grace will then open. Quickly, get back behind my walls, put on your armor and pick up your sword. The Lord is my rock and my fortress and my deliverer, my God, my strength, in whom I will trust, my shield and the horn of my salvation, my stronghold. Psalms 18 verse 2.